guys, so today I'm here with the Spring Flings or Spring Things tag. I'm not quite sure the name of the tag is and that's really awkward. But um, I'll put the correct title above. Um, anyway, so I was tagged by Laguna Beach Love 10, who is one of my favorite people to watch on YouTube. So make sure to check the description box, I'll put her link down there, as well as the girl that came up with this tag, who is that Missy Girl 7, and I'll put down below as well the people that I tag. So just make sure to check the description box, there's a ton of stuff in there, just check it out. So there are three categories to this spring tag, there's beauty, fashion, and hair, so the first category is beauty. The first question is, what is your go-to palette for spring? And as much as I want to say the Naked palette, like I love using the Naked palette, I use it often. Um, Definitely the NYX Champagne and Caviar palette. Um, this is probably one of my favorite drugstore-ish. I say drugstore very loosely because I feel like you can only get it at Ulta. But this is one of my favorite drugstore palettes. It's $10, or when I bought it, it was $10. And it's just the best whoopsies neutrals I've ever used. As you can see, I've hit pan on five of them. I've lost the shadows, so that's awesome. But I use these two colors every day, this light kind of shimmery color and this taupe. Um, this is my favorite like neutral palette, and I'm, I get a lot of use out, it on a, use out of it on an everyday basis. I've had it about two years, so um, I feel like this is definitely going to be one of the go-to palettes that I use for spring. The next question is, what is your favorite spring blush color? So in my blush collection, I have a lot of pinks. A lot. I think that's all I have is pinks and maybe like one purple, but that's in like a box. But um, the color that I've been wearing the most recently, which is probably going to end up being in my March favorites, is my Ulta Cheek Color in Afternoon Delight. Fun fact, this was the very first blush that I bought. I bought this and I bought another one as well because it was like buy one get one free. So I've already used that one up completely, but this is my first blush, yay. So this is just a really nice kind of light pinky color with a little bit of golden shimmer to it, but it's really subtle, you don't really see it. But because I'm so fair coming into the springtime, because I mean... I'm really pale anyway. Um, this is just this just looks really great on my skin tone. So the next question is, what is your go-to face product? That would be bronzing um, because, like I said, I am so pale. I need to start getting my tan game up, and I have two bronzing products to show you. The first is the one I just received in my My Glam bag for March, and it's the Murad Absolute Bronzing Boost. This is just like a liquid bronzer you mix in with your foundation, and it just kind of gives you a little bit of a tan glow, so I'm definitely going to be using this. But the bronzer that I use on an everyday basis is the NYC Smooth Skin Bronzing Face Powder in Sunny, which I feel like is a cult favorite, but it's just probably one of the best matte bronzers i found at the drugstore, and it's super duper cheap. So that is my go-to face product for the springtime. The next question is, what is your go-to spring lip combo? And I'm so excited about this, this lip combo because it's just so pretty together. The, fir the first item, I'm like mixing up my words, is the MAC, my new MAC lipstick in Angel, which is a frost. It's a really pretty kind of nudie pink, almost a little bit more on the pinky side, and it's really, really sh pretty shade. And on top of that, I put the NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss in Sweetheart, which is like, it's basically the same color, a little bit more on the pinky side, but it just gives a really nice kind of glossy look to the lips. I'm not too sure why I opened that. So yeah, that's my favorite lip combo for springtime. And the last question in the beauty category, ow, is what are your top three spring nail polishes? And this is so hard for me. I make a favorite nail polish picks for every season, so you'll see this in a couple more, or after a couple more videos. But um, this was so hard for me to pick three because I love nail polish, and there's a ton of spring colors. So I have three Essie polishes. I've narrowed it down, and they're all pastel colors because I love pastels for spring. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. So the three colors that I chose... The first one is St. Lucia Lilac, which is just this really pretty pastel purple color. Love this. The next one is Mint Candy Apple, which is a mint green. I also have Refreshment from China Glaze, which I really like. And then the last one is Borrowed in Blue, which is just, it looks almost white, but it's just a really nice light um, sky blue color. So those are my favorite pastels so far for <laughs> the springtime. The next category is fashion. First question is, what is your favorite spring clothing trend? Um, I'm not too sure if this is a trend, but I really like the shirts that have cut out shoulders, but not like too dramatic, just like a little cuts. I think those are super cute. I also really like um, colored jeans. I don't know if I'm ever going to get any. If I do, they'll probably be like turquoise. I really do want to get white jeans, but I just think colored jeans on a lot of people look really, really cute. The next question is, what do you always find yourself wearing in the springtime? Um, 
I don't know, I wear cardigans, but like I wear cardigans all the time. I guess I wear lighter colored cardigans, like more springy colors. Um, I've been trying to wear dresses more, which is nice. I only own like three casual dresses, and I'm not trying to get all fancied up for going to school, but um, so yeah, I'm trying to get into wearing dresses more. So the next category is hair, and the first question in that category is, what is your favorite hair trend? Ombre hair. I love it. I, at first, like, I feel like when I first started filming videos, I almost had ombre hair because I dyed my hair and it was, like, blonde, but then it was, like, really dark down here. Um, but I, I love it. I think ombre hair looks so cute. If I had the balls, I would do it, but I just, I don't. And, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I think ombre hair is super duper cute. It's probably my favorite hair trend. And then the last question of this tag is, what is your favorite hairstyle for spring? Scrunched hair. If you can tell, um, I'm going to be doing a video on scrunched hair. I'll put that up next. I, I love scrunching my hair. I, I love it in the springtime because it just looks beachy and wavy and just gets me so pumped for the summer. Um, I just love scrunching my hair. So that's it for the spring tag. Like I said, make sure to check the down bar for the people that I tag. Hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry I look a little crazy. My bangs are getting long. I don't have makeup on. Or I do have makeup on, but it's not a lot. But um, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said, subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you in my next video.